In this lesson, we're going to talk about how to multiply whole numbers and fractions together. So for the first example, we have 9 times 2 over 7. 9 is the same as 9 over 1, so you can write it this way and then multiply across. So we have 9 times 2, which is 18. 7 times 1, that's 7. Now what about the next one? 12 times 3 over 4. Well, we could do the same thing. We could write this as 12 over 1 times 3 over 4. 12 times 3 is 36. 1 times 4 is 4. And 36 divided by 4 is 9. So that's the answer for the second example. For the sake of practice, go ahead and try these two. Feel free to pause the video if you want to. So let's start with the first example, 3 over 5 times 8. So we can write it at 3 over 5 times 8 over 1. And then we could multiply across. 8 times 3 is 24. 5 times 1 is 5. So that's going to give us the answer, 24 over 5, as an improper fraction. Now what about the last example? So we can write this as 24 over 1. Now, if we were to multiply across, we're going to get a large number. Something else that we can do is we could divide before we multiply. We could divide 24 by 8. Or you can see it this way. So this is 5 over 8. 24, we could break that into 8 times 3. And notice that we could cancel the 8. So we're just going to be left with 5 times 3 over 1, and that's going to simplify to 15. So whenever you have examples like that, sometimes you can, if you see a common factor, in this case 8, you can cancel it and make the problem a lot easier. So that's something you want to keep in mind.